staying positive in a negative world. Hi, I'm Krista with New Day Grace, where we empower and encourage you for each new day. We have a really special book we want to give to you as a free download. Seven things to do every day for a prosperous day. You can find the link in the description below. Now in this video, I want to talk about staying positive in a negative world. There are some really effective things we can do that can make a big difference. So let's find out what they are. Let's get started. Negativity is all around us. We hear it and see it every day in the news and how people talk in our communities and in our world. However, positivity is all around us as well. Sometimes we may have to look a little harder to find the good and positive, but more than that, we can choose to be a positive person and live a positive life. You may have heard the quote, you can't live a positive life with a negative mind. The Word of God instructs us to renew our minds and change the way we think. We choose the thoughts that occupy our attention and focus. Philippians 4.8 says, Fix your thoughts on what is true and honorable and right and pure and lovely and admirable. Think about things that are excellent and worthy of praise. Filling our mind with thoughts that help us to stay hopeful, thankful, and positive does not discount or diminish the negativity in the world, but it helps us to cope better, trust God, and have a better overall outlook. We look for and give our attention to the good, not the bad in other people, and in ourselves, and in everything around us. We talk more about what is right than what is wrong. We focus more on the possibilities and not the obstacles. We talk victory and not defeat, success and not failure. And we keep on practicing and practicing until our old way of thinking and believing is replaced and faith and positivity becomes a part of us. With consistency and practice, our minds will be renewed and our brains will be rewired. Positive, hopeful, faith-filled thinking must be reinforced with action. We must be doers of the word, not hearers only. Let's knock on those doors and keep knocking until one opens. Let's persist and stay focused on our goals until we reach them. Positive, faith-filled thinking requires persistence and resilience. That means we don't quit, and if we get knocked down, we get back up. Our faith will sometimes wane. We will be tempted to get negative. We might be tempted to think, this isn't working. What is the point? But it does work. If we fall, we must get back up again. Renew our faith. Practice positive, faith-filled thinking. Act on it, and we will succeed. We can be positive in a negative world. It all begins with our thoughts and beliefs. I encourage you to believe that life is good because God is good. And no matter how dark and negative things can be at times, the light will always dispel the darkness. Today is a new day. That means we have new opportunities to learn, grow, love, and laugh. It means we have new mercies and a clean slate to start fresh. This is the day the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. Psalm 118.24 Let's stay positive and hopeful. Let's look for the good and find it. Let's make the best of today and enjoy it. Thank you for watching this video. We hope you enjoyed it. Visit NewDayBooks.com today to get your free book, 7 Things to Do Every Day for a Prosperous Day. You can find the link in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a comment, like, share, and subscribe to our New Day Grace channel.